world peace. It's, you know, there's, there is so much to it. There is so much to world peace. Should we have hope? Why do we have hope? Is it something that we can touch? Is it something that we should have? Is it a pipe dream? I don't know. Is it a pipe dream? We need to have hope. We need to have something that we are working towards. We need to have dreams in life to, to, to work towards something, to aspire to be something, someone. And what does world peace look like? Kindness. So humans getting along with other humans. Do we have that in our world today? I am not sure. I'm not sure if us humans get along with each other. And it's not so much of getting along, it's about acceptance. And when we have that acceptance, we can have peace in the world and we can have peace within ourselves and we don't have to have war. We don't have to fight each other for different belief systems. We, we don't have to have hatred. We don't have to harm each other. It's just having peace. In mystery school, our teachings, our knowledge, our teachings, the mystery school's role in this is to empower people. This is what the modern mystery school is about. Modern mystery school is about empowerment, empowering people to be the better version of yourself, to have responsibility. Yes, we all have, we can all have issues. We can all come from different backgrounds. We can all have different traumatic experiences in our life. But the modern mystery school gives us the tools to empower us, to heal. And what they give us is the awareness of light that we can bring within ourselves and bring into the world. And working in the light and for the light can move us towards world peace. And why? Why? It's because the more we work on ourselves and become the better version of ourselves, lifting of our, ourselves up to the greater potential, then we can bring world peace in into the world and also bring it into the consciousness of others.